Hello, everyone. It's Corbin again from the Chill Project. I wanted to take today to talk about uh, self care and, and the importance of self care. Uh, self care is the duty that we have to take care of ourselves. Um, life can be very busy, very stressful at times, uh, to the point where we can feel burnout. Um, and burnout is that feeling of exhaustion. Uh, in burnout, we can feel extra irritable, our emotions all, all over the place. So today we can talk about, well, what are some simple things that we can do uh, to make sure that we're, we're treating ourselves and we're treating our burnout here. Um, when, when I talk to people, I help them uh, just take care of the basic things, making sure you're getting enough sleep, getting enough to eat, um, focusing more on hygiene, focusing on the simple things when, when you're in burnout, uh, rather than um, focusing on the big things. Um, and then we go from there. But thinking about uh, one thing that you can do uh, to, to help. Uh, one thing that you can look forward to, something that you really like. Uh, for me and my self-care, um, I focus more on making sure I, I get myself active, uh, whether it's a walk or I get to the gym, I focus on eating, I focus on sleeping. Uh, so it's more of you, you treat yourself physically and you also treat yourself uh, psychologically. Um, and we'll come up with a plan today. I, I, I have a handout for everyone to work on their own self-care plan, but it might be helpful to talk more about how do we know that we're in burnout? So during burnout, we can feel exhaustion. We can feel irritable and it kind of feels like we're not ourselves. And sometimes people outside of us can notice it before we do. So if you have a someone who cares deeply about you and they notice that hey you're you're starting to look like you're you're getting burnt out here you know that it, it's time to bring things back and, and focus on the simple things um i've i have a handout for everyone to work on today um just focusing on a self-care plan um and uh, so we'll we'll go over the three parts the mind body and spirit so with the mind, doing something that can help with, um, with easing the mind. This could be reading, this could be listening to music, um, anything that can kind of help with, with that, um, with body. Um, for me, it's exercise. Some people might would take a walk, go get a massage, get your hair done, um, focusing on just the simple tasks here. Uh, with your spirit, you can um, practice your religion practice your spirituality. Mindfulness can also be part of that as well. It's up to everyone um, and what they would, what they really like to do. Uh, supportive people in my life, um, come up with three, see if you can get to five. And also, what do you want to accomplish? Knowing that the state that you're in is only temporary and you are going to feel better. Um, and what would you accomplish to help you feel better about where you are right now and where you might be going? So I'm going to leave you to complete that. But this has been Corbin again from The Chill Project. Take care and stay safe.